We're trying to create a cycle of good, and how we do this is we ask publishers to donate both print and digital properties. We ask marketers to consider this very unique media buy with a dual purpose, and we ask our agency partners to help us execute these buys and to help promote this to your clients. This is the single biggest way that you can really impact the ad club, by shifting this thought of business as usual and doing something that raises the consciousness of all of us to do the right thing. And as Valerie said, and has a lot of people, Jack Myers commented, it is all about representing what the population looks like. And if we call ourselves communicators, then we really need to reflect that in a big way. One of the things that um, we instituted a couple of years back was taking time to really acknowledge the people who help us, because this is sort of this very grassroots group of people who you know, sit behind the desks at agencies and media companies and client companies, but they bring this to life. And so we established something called the Action Awards, because without their actions, this doesn't propel forward. So here we are with the 2016 Action Award recipients. I'd like to acknowledge the efforts of these three champions. I'm going to ask them to come up, take a photo op, and say a few words about their involvement. The first is Maria Mandel, Vice President and Head of Marketing at AT&T AdWorks. <laughs> Maria is a new partner, but she is totally engaged and enthusiastic. She has her folks represented well on both our Media Action Committee and our Steering Committee. And we're very proud that AT&T sort of represents both don donor and purchaser. So congratulations to you, and thank you very much. We'll come up here just to take a quick go back. Thank you very much. It's very nice. Well, first of all, I'm deeply honored to receive this award. Uh, diversity is something that is very important to me, um, something that I myself have seen make a change uh, in the teams that I work with. Being involved with the Media Action I'm Part program is very important because I've seen it create meaningful differences. I've seen it not only attract new groups of people into our industry, but also mentor and train and elevate people to executive levels, which is so needed in our industry. I'm very fortunate to be part of a company, AT&T, that truly values and supports diversity and is part of the Media Action I'm Part program. Uh, my own team uh, is, is very diverse, uh, various gender, race, uh, religion, cultural backgrounds. And what I think they'll all agree on, besides the tough deadlines and dislike of those, all those projects I give them, uh, that was a joke, uh, <laughs> <laughs> is um, that being part of a diverse team, and when I was talking about this award, we started talking about how truly diverse our team is and, and how interesting it is to work with people that have different points of views and different life experiences. And it not only makes it a more interesting place to work, but it makes it more fun and actually produces greater results. And what I found from my own experience is that diversity really does drive innovation at companies. And that's why it's important for me personally and for our company to be part of the Media Action I'm Part program. Thank you, Maria. Tom Davis, Chief Marketing Officer at Forbes Media. Forbes has supported media action since its inception 17 years ago. Tom ensures that the commitment is realized every year. It is the generosity of the publishing community that makes this fundraising work. So we are indebted to the publishers forever. And Tom, thank you so much for your part in that. Thank you. We're going to try you in the middle. Sure. Thank you. 
Well, thanks. There's been so much said already about this topic, I don't know what to add, so I'm going to keep it short. I will just say thank you to the Ad Club and Gina and Chris, because you guys really make this easy to do the right thing. And at Forbes, we're doing a lot that tries to uh, have a positive impact. And Saturday, I'll be going to uh, Israel with 600 other young entrepreneurs um, from the US and Europe and Middle East and Africa uh, to really do a lot of things, but to share mentorship, entrepreneurship, and really give back to, to a lot of the schools and coexist and make a difference in that part of the world. And we're doing that here in the States. We're doing that with our richest people and trying to find uh, ways to bring food to, to New York City shelters and healthcare to the last mile in, in Liberia and other things. So the last five years we've been doing a lot and that's not easy. But what the Ad Club is doing here with Impart is really easy. So thank you for doing it and thanks for the recognition. Thank you. Thanks. Last but certainly not least is Karen Kakuza. She is Director of Print Investment at OMD. Karen is a longtime supporter and friend. She continues to bring marketers to the table like Lily and now PepsiCo. She always comes through, keeps us top of mind, which I know in everybody's busy day is not an easy thing to do. So Karen, we can always count on you and we can't thank you enough. Good morning, everyone. It is an honor to be recognized by the Advertising Club, and I'm very happy to receive the 2016 Ad Club Action Award today. Um, I would like to thank Gina and Gina Griller and Chris Early for their partnership. It has been a pleasure to work with them on the Media Action I'm Part Initiative over the years. I applaud them for their continued efforts in raising awareness and challenging the marketplace to embrace diversity and pursue diversity and inclusion in every aspect of our everyday lives. I personally enjoyed working with the publishing community as well as our clients to promote the importance of diversity in the workforce. The Ed Club's Media Action Program continues to remind all of us how critical it is to attract, retain, train, and promote diversified talent in the workplace. Over the years, it has been great to see how Gina and Chris and their team have continued to grow and evolve this program while fostering so many impactful relationships. They've done an outstanding job of providing opportunities for up-and-coming talent while leveraging resources in the marketplace to bring these opportunities to life. I fully support their vision to empower talented individuals while encouraging our industry to welcome them to the conversation. Lastly, I share this award with my team, the print investment team at OMD in New York. Um, together, we have shared a commitment to supporting the Ad Club as an agency and on behalf of our clients. From a personal and professional perspective, it is very fulfilling to be part of this initiative. It is an honor and a pleasure to work with a team of talented professionals who are dedicated and committed to ensuring our industry is representative from a diversity perspective. So thank you again very much. Thank you. Enjoy the afternoon. I thank you all for indulging us. There is material on the table. I would be remiss if I didn't shout out to Chris Early, who is my partner in crime for doing this for many, many years. And we, she is the one that really um, is on top of all the publishers and all the agency partners. And so I thank you, Chris, for your commitment to this. Valerie, thank you for joining us today. And to all the publishers who currently participate, you have no idea that we could never do this without you. So thank you very much. And I'll turn it back over to Audrey because we have a lot more in store. <laughs>